when we set up a brand new website, usually we get this ugly website title with a little description if there is. And then there is a page title that we just want to remove it all together from all the pages. So in this video, I'm going to show you five options, how to remove them, how to change them in your website settings in different areas of your website. So without further ado, let's dive right in. Now, the first option while I'm here in the WP admin dashboard is head over to appearance and then head over to customize. And when it loaded, you want to head over to your site identity. And over here, you'll be able to see that you can define your site logo over here and then change the site title over here if you want to. And also the tagline over here. Now, you can also set up the side icon. As you can see here, the side icon would be this little icon that we can see on our tabs over here that will tell our users in a glance what our website is all about or that usually is referred to your logo or just a little icon that you can set up for your website. Now that we're done that, you can just click out of that. And the next option is just by defining a template for your header and footer or for that matter, just a header. So head over to your templates and head over to all and you want to set up a new template and then just define as your header as we can see here, main header and then header. In my case, I already have pre-made header for that. So I'll head over there. And when you're here, you just want to define it to include on all your websites. So head over to the upward arrow or the save options right next to the update button, then just click it and head over to display conditions. And over here, as we can see here, I just excluded the, this is the page title from the first page that we've seen in the beginning of this video. Now I will just remove it and then I'll just save changes. Now, when I head over back to my page over here, if I'll go back to pages and I'll head over to this page over here, I'll then I'll click view and we'll be able to see we have our header over here. And the next thing that I want to show you here is how to remove this title right over here. Now, there are a few options, but the first one would be through the edit page of Elementor. So head over and edit this page with Elementor. And then you want to head over to the settings at the bottom left hand corner of your screen. And then you'll be able to see here we have high title. As you can see here, just click it and then the title will disappear and you'll have only the page that you can see here. Now, if you also want to remove, if you have the footer over here or you have all the comments over here, what you want to do is head over to your page layout and just switch it from default to Elementor full width. That would remove the comments, but this is the footer of the website. So you would want to also configure the footer on your website through Elementor and also define it that it will be site wide. And once you're done, just click update. Now, the next thing I want to show you is how you can change your site title and tagline and also your site icon through the settings of your website. So in order to do that, you want to head over back and then just exit the Elementor Web Page Builder Editor. And when you're here, you just want to click the WordPress icon over here on the top left and corner of your screen and then head over to your settings and then hit general. And when you're here, you'll be able to see that we have our site title right over here and then the tagline right beneath it. And then right under that, we have site icon. Same thing here. You just click it, you define your site icon and you're good to go. But let's say you don't want to head over to the Elementor Editor and then over there, you want to define the settings and you just want to delete it all together. So what you want to do is head over to the appearance and then head over to the theme settings. If you're using Hello Elementor, that will be visible to you over here. As we can see here, we have disabled page title over here that will remove the section above the content that contains the main heading of the page. And you just enable it and then just save settings. And that pretty much does it for this video. I really hope this video helped you. And if it did, I'd be really glad to if you leave a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any tutorial that I post on Elementor, WooCommerce and WordPress. And as always, I'll be seeing you in the next one.